Next up on copycat.com, foolproof pie crust made with a food processor. We're gonna make pie dough and you know it only has five simple ingredients and we're gonna use a food processor to do it because pie dough is very easy to make with a food processor. You can put this together in just about two minutes. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. We're gonna add one and a quarter cup of flour into my food processor. I'm gonna add two tablespoons of sugar we're gonna use this dough with a sweet pie in mind. If you're making a savory pie, you can leave out the sugar. A quarter teaspoon of salt. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and put this in the food processor and blend it together so all the ingredients mix well. All right, so I've mixed together all of my dry ingredients and now I'm gonna add a half cup of butter or four ounces of butter into here. So this obviously is a butter crust. I think they have great flavor. So we're just gonna put these into the food processor and we're just gonna pulse it a few times until it gets nice and crumbly. So once the dough has become nice and crumbly, you're gonna go ahead and add in about a quarter cup of water. You may need a little bit more. Now I'm using ice water here. and we're gonna continue to pulse it. So you can see I'm stopping right now. You don't need to wait till it forms up a complete ball. You want it to where it's nice and coarse like this. It's gonna hold its shape well when we make a ball of it. So I'm gonna put it on a little bit of saran wrap because I'm gonna cool mine down before I use it. Okay, so now I'm just gonna shape it into a ball. So if you look at this right now, you'll actually notice that there's still bits of butter that haven't fully blended in here, but that's okay. They're gonna be just fine in cooking. So we're gonna just simply fold this over and put this in the fridge. Now you could freeze this if you like. You can freeze this for about 30 days and just defrost it overnight in your refrigerator and you have the perfect pie dough. This will make one bottom for a nine inch pie. So if you need a top and a bottom, you should double this recipe. So if you enjoy this video and wanna learn how to make more great videos, be sure to go over to the blog, copycat.com, for all sorts of great recipes. Thanks for watching.